I found the perfect basement craft room lights. Keep watching. I'm Brandy and this is Making It My Own. All right, I usually do crafts, but today you're gonna get to see the mess that lies behind and around me. I want you to note that it is a basement. It is dark. All I have on right now are the two umbrella lights that are above my craft table. You can look at this for someone who doesn't do any photography or recording at home and think, well, what are you talking about? I can see everything. For instance, the crack around where the basement and the floor and the ceiling there meet, that's got to be repaired. But let's just pretend like we don't have that there. Here's my situation with my flowers. This is real life. This is, I'm not going to clean it up before I do the video type of situation. I have had all kinds of issues. There is no lighting down here except for what we bring in and plug into an extension cord. So you can see extension cords all over the place. That's my daughter on the ladder helping me out. Okay, so I was approached by this company. I think their name is On For You and they are from Amazon. They have all types of lights. They come on these spools and they're LED lights that attach to the wall. Now they have a sticky backing on the strip. Plus they have these little foam sticky tape pieces that you can stick on there too, like to reinforce things. Look what it looks like after you get these up. Do you see the huge difference? Now I don't care about what it looks like on the ceiling. That light that is coming from that the top of that wall downward has given me so much more clarity. I can see so much better. Y'all, I am 48 years old. I need to be wearing glasses. Half the time I don't. I use my computer downstairs. I do all my crafting down here, plus we have storage. It is very difficult for me when I don't have enough lighting to work efficiently. Look at this. Look how much more clear this is. Like I can see everything. I can quickly find things. It's so much easier. This is not a sponsored video, but they were, you know, sent to me so that I could try them out, and I absolutely love them. I'm not saying that because I didn't have to pay for them. I'm saying that because this is the perfect solution. You're going to see here now where we go across the corner on the back side here where the light strip stops, and these are two light strips that are connected together. You can see how dark it is over there on that side and how much brighter it is right here. There is a control that, um, there's a little knob that I'll show you in a moment that you can turn back and forth and that's like a dimmer switch. It's gonna get the lights brighter for you or lower, which is convenient when I'm doing Halloween footage because I can dim the lights and you can see my candle lights over there better. I mean, this is so much better and we're getting on the edge of where the light cuts off and you can still see See the difference back here? Now look on that back wall. See how much more dark that looks back there? Very dark. But coming back this way immediately, the light changes. Everything gets brighter. I love this. I don't have the convenience of having a window to look through and I don't have the right type of electricity down here to, you know, to work the fan, to work the lights and do that sort of thing. Cause you see my umbrella lights here. Those are huge studio lights in there too. Okay, you're gonna see flashing lights in a minute cause I'm gonna do some adjustments, but I wanted to sh leave all that wire out there so that you can see how it's connected together. That won't look like that when I get my new backdrops. It's all gonna be hidden nicely. Okay, so here I am just turning the dimmer back and forth and it clicks off if you turn it all the way. So you can see the different levels. And when the light's on, you can't see the, the damage up there near the ceiling either, which makes it convenient. Now this is at about half, half strength here, and I still have a lot of light. Look at that. So I've just got it running into an extension cord right now. Don't be like me. If, if you, you know, do, do stuff right. We're just doing what we can right now. So I'm just showing you here what it looks like with the lighting and then what it looks like without the lighting. Okay. Now we're going to turn them off. And you see how much more dull that looks? much more dull. 
I can see, but it's not clear. And when you use a camera and you take pictures and you video and you make videos, it is very difficult if you don't have a lot of lighting. I like them, but you know, you do what you need to do for your, you know, personal budget and that sort of thing. Although I will tell you that my daughter has purchased some as well and they are very, very good price point. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye.